So now I'm going to be landing in Dubai at 1 in the morning and then start my day immediately straight to the visa office and uh, try and get my visa renewed to be able to get back into India three days after two days on the track and a day with the gumball on Chapter J. So, fingers crossed. So, a stressful start to the morning. Only had a few hours sleep after coming back from Chennai. Now back in Dubai and going off to like the third place to try and sort out this Indian visa issue because I got issued a single entry uh, visa when it should have been multiple. So now it looks like I'm gonna have to go back and get four different single entry visas after every trip coming back from India because I have work in Dubai in between the championships. So running on uh, not much energy and uh, not much sleep and uh, had to cancel a few things this morning to get this done. So I'm off to the consulate now and uh, gonna try and get my visa sorted. And then uh, later on today, going to uh, pack and get everything ready. <laughs> the visa appointment and yeah obviously couldn't film in there but pretty stressful but I think we're sorted I've got three more entries that I've got to be able to do one is in three days two days um to Hyderabad which is the first uh race weekend of Indian Racing League and it's the first time ever we're racing on the brand new Hyderabad street circuit which is going to be the Formula E circuit so uh it's great to have the inaugural event there but I just need to get there in the first place so um my passport's gone. I hope I see it in two days. In between those two days, um, tomorrow with the F1 cars and Group C cars, shaking them down for the Gulf Historic. And then from there, driving to Ras Al Khaimah to meet the Gumball guys and then doing two days of the Gumball, ending at the track day at Dubai Autodrome where I then get a lift straight to the airport, hopefully with visa and passport in hand. Um, but yeah, I'm back at uh, our apartment in Dubai. Maybe I'll give you a little bit of a tour. Very, very lucky with... This view behind us, the sunset's just over there. Harbour down here, Vida Hotel, which is beautiful. Take uh, a little Cali on walks down there. And uh, yeah, we've got uh, one bed here, bathroom through into here. And then I will give you a little tour of the main room and guest room where our nanny Leah and Cali are. Where's Cali? Cali. exciting one today mostly due diligence getting everything ready for the next two three days so i think we'll uh, fast forward to the exciting stuff tomorrow so it is the next morning and i'm on the way to dubai autodrome now um didn't get much sleep because nyla was going to cyprus this morning she is off to do a ted talks can't believe nyla's not been in any of the vlogs yet but we're only a couple in um so she has gone off to cyprus to do a ted talks which i'm so proud of her for and I have to miss it, which is so frustrating. I did have flights to go there. It clashes with so many things with Abu Dhabi F1, uh, with the Gumball, with a track day that I'd already pre-organized and with the Indian Racing League happening in Hyderabad. So um, she left at 5 a.m. I'm now on the way to Dubai Autodrome to shake down the F1 and Group C, hopefully one of the silk cut ones, silk cut ones, which would be amazing. Um, I meet the guys from GPX and then from there, I will uh, take an Uber to Raz Al Khaimah to meet the Gumball 3000 guys and MJ, good friend and the last person that I did some Gumball with in his Ferrari, um, which was Miami, what is it, Miami? No, it was to Athens, which was incredible. I'll put a couple of pictures in here now. Uh, I want to 
say thank you to everybody. So I'm really excited for the next couple of days, but it's gonna be absolutely back to back. We then got a track day at Dubai Autodrome two days after that, then to the Abu Dhabi F1 for Friday, and then that night, an overnight flight to India to the Hyderabad race. <laughs> So now at the track, just been out in the 30s, kind of had to get rushed into the car. So we're at Dubai Autodrome here, which is uh, only about 15 minutes from where I'm based. And now in these two garages over here, which I'll give you a close up look to in a minute, we've got the F1 30s car, the Mazda Group C rotary engine and Porsche Group C as well. Um, amazing cars. We'll give you a little bit of a flavor of how they sound, how they look. Sorry about my helmet hair. And we're testing them here which is the circuit where the Golf Historic is going to be based. And uh, yeah, we had a little bit of a fuel pump issue, but we're gonna go out and uh, rectify that. So third session done now and uh, now out into the Group C cars after being out in the uh, F1 car which is now working perfectly. The Mazda Rotor engine which sounds amazing is also now working. The Porsche is just starting up now in behind the garage. So all done, changed, and just waiting for my Uber now to head to Ras Al Khaimah. So I think this is a good point to end today's vlog before the chaos of Gumball starts for the next couple of days. Leaving my kit here to pick it back up because in two more days, we're gonna be back here for the Gumball track day with 120 cars here. So see you then.